We are now going to write terms of sequences with factorials. So suppose we're given the general term a of n is minus 1 to the n times 2 to the n divided by n factorial. So remember that this piece right here says we're going to change signs and our first term is going to be negative because it's going to be minus 1 to the 1. So we just start with negatives and then it goes negative, positive, negative, positive. Well, if we want to write the first five terms, then a1 is equal to minus 1 to the 1 times 2 to the 1 divided by 1 factorial. So we evaluate this. This is minus 1 times 2 divided by 1, which is minus 2. a2 is minus 1 to the 2 times 2 to the 2 divided by 2 factorial. So that's going to be a positive 1. 4 and 2 factorial is 2 times 1 times 1, which is just 2. 1 times 4 is 4. 4 divided by 2 is 2. a3 is minus 1 to the third times 2 to the third divided by 3 factorial. So it's going to be a negative 1 times an 8 divided by 3 times 2. And I'm writing it out deliberately that way. I don't need these, so I'm just not going to write them. The 1 factorial and the 0 factorial don't change anything. The 8 and the 2 reduce to a 4, and so this becomes minus 4 thirds. Well, a4 is minus 1 to the 4th times 2 to the 4th divided by 4 factorial. So again, this turns into a positive 1. 2 to the 4th is 16, 2 more than the last, 2 times more than the last one. And this becomes 4 times 3 times 2, and again I'm stopping there because the 1's aren't going to help. The 4 and the 16 leaves a 4, the 4 and the 2 leaves a 2, so this becomes positive 2 thirds. And a5 is minus 1 to the 5th times 2 to the 5th divided by 5 factorial, which is a minus 1, a 32, a 5 times 4 times 3 times 2. 32 and 4 is 8. 8 and 2 is 4. So we end up with a negative 4 fifteenths. So my first five terms are minus 2, positive 2, minus 4 thirds, 2 thirds, and minus 4 fifteenths. And I found the first five terms of a sequence that uses factorials.